what they call nutria. N U T R I A. Yeah. They're so like a mix between a beaver and a muskrat. And a rat. But, <laughs> but it was introduced down here in 1937. They brought 13 of them down to mix free with the muskrats, helping the first doing it on the rooting system to the oh. marshland, causing what they call edos. Yeah. Flood a hurricane comes through, washing all wetlands away. So about 10 years ago, they put a bounty on him. Right around like we're doing, see him, shooting with 22 rifle, chop seven inches of his tail off to prove that he killed it, bring the tail into the state to give him five bucks for the tail. Oh, God. Just to show you how I many they had, 15 <gasps> days, they almost killed 7,000 of them. Oh. Probably 700 a day. God. Wow. Right, you catch the next one, you seen how I did that? Female, you know how you can tell she's a female? David, right here. Uh-uh. 
He's always fussing, always got a mouth open. <laughs> Come on, girl. She waits for you, huh? I don't know why she does all that fussing. Come on. Oh, good. <laughs> Come on. No, no, no. <laughs> Come on, girl. She says, you come on. I have to play this game every time. <laughs> come on, girl. Hi, right, I give it to you. I ain't gonna come let on, you work too hard. Come on, get your nose right. Get your nose up. <laughs> Watch it, she can lift her head up. Chomp, chomp, it's down. Going. Oh my gosh. This one of big owls go. For we have a 13 foot. I couldn't find them last tour and I feel like I ain't find them again this tour. But he's starting to mate, like I said earlier. So he's doing a lot of moving around, uh -huh. checking out his territory, making sure his girlfriends ain't fooling around on him. Uh -huh. If any males come in his area, he's running them out or eating them or something. Uh, but that's how we start feeding her. We're just feeding him and she come around. And that's it. Nice. I don't know why she does all that fussing on.